series, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. It is honor to welcome His Excellency, Mr. Together with Madame Lawrence Wong, and all the delegates, Prime Minister of the Kingdom of Thailand. Excellency, Madame, distinguished guests, welcome you all to Thailand and to the government house. I'm very pleased to welcome you all here today, and it is, it is my honor. I hope that uh, the Prime Minister and everybody here can feel like Thailand is your second home and can always come back to find friends here. And we all welcome you every time that you want to visit us again. Next year is our 60th anniversary diplomatic relations, so it's a very good year. Today is like we have a little um, celebration in advance for our, world, uh, our two countries. And I like to say that we will be very honored to welcome your president here in Thailand for the um, official visit in the future. And of course, in the future, uh, I will have a chance to see the prime minister uh, quite often because we're gonna have to join the meetings around the globe together. So we wish to continue our discussion today to make a progress and um, to discuss more in, in the future matters. So everybody please um, join me to toast for uh, the good health and happiness of His Excellency and to everybody. Thank you. Your Excellency, Prime Minister Betong Tan, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen, once again, let me thank the Prime Minister for your warm hospitality extended to me and my delegation. Prime Minister Betong Tan and I are new leaders of our respective countries. Uh, we spoke over the phone earlier in September. Then we met for the first time at our first ASEAN summit in Laos and today I'm happy to make my introductory visit and also honoured to be the first foreign leader to make an official visit to Thailand since the Prime Minister's appointment. Uh, Singapore and Thailand are old friends. The friendship between our two countries predates Singapore's nationhood. In 1871, His Majesty King Chulalongkorn made his first overseas visit to Singapore when we were still a British colony. He gave the people of Singapore a bronze elephant statue that still stands in our old Parliament House as the testimony to the enduring friendship between our two peoples. In 1965, Thailand was the first, one of the first countries to recognize Singapore's independence and we will always appreciate Thailand's support for our sovereignty. So as old friends, there's a deep reservoir of trust between Thailand and Singapore. And earlier at the press conference, Prime Minister Petong Tan and I discussed not only the existing elements of our bilateral relationship like defense, trade and investments, but also expanding our collaboration into new areas like food security, energy security, as well as the green economy and digital connectivity. So we look forward to expanding our collaboration and cooperation and taking our relationship to even greater heights. Of course, the good ties between the government and between the two countries are anchored by very close people-to-people -people links. Many Singaporeans enjoy coming to Thailand for their vacation, especially when there is a long weekend or public holiday. 
I think many Singaporeans will know where are the best food places in Bangkok, where are the best places to shop in Bangkok, and likewise, many Thais are very familiar with Singapore too. So we are happy to see this two-way travel between our people. We want to encourage more of that, and we also want to work together to encourage more travellers to come to our two countries. And we are glad to see these closer links form between our two people as they study, live and work in our respective countries and also learn more about one another's culture. For example, we had a Thai music festival in Singapore in January this year and we will be showcasing contemporary Thai art at our art museum later next month. Thai films are well received in Singapore. They thrive both in our cinemas and on streaming platforms. Like the recent Thai film, which all of you know, How to Make Millions Before Grandma Dies, which broke Singapore's box office records just days after its release. Uh, we welcome Thai students in our schools and institutions of higher learning. Uh, some of them find opportunities to work in Singapore and contribute to our economy. And likewise, many Singapore students visit Thailand on exchange programs and more and more are seeking opportunities in Thailand too. So all of these exchanges and initiatives augur well for the future of our bilateral ties. And next year, as the Prime Minister said, I look forward to welcoming her and Mr. Bidok to Singapore for our Diamond Jubilee. And we look forward to working closely together to bring the Singapore-Thailand friendship to even greater heights. Prime Minister Petong Tan, Mr. Bidok, Excellencies, Distinguished Guests, may I now invite you to join me in a toast to His Majesty King Maha Wachi Balongkong of the Kingdom of Thailand, to the continued good health and success of Prime Minister Te Tong Tan and Mr. Pido, to the continued peace and prosperity of Thailand and the enduring friendship between our two countries. Cheers. <laughs>